welcome to this brand new edition of Climate Clock and today we are going to talk about some updates that have come in in the nuclear energy space. Scientists have made a major breakthrough towards nuclear fusion that could mean low carbon energy. The team at Joint European Taurus of Jet Labs in Oxford have smashed the world record of producing record amount of energy by squeezing two forms of hydrogen, that is nuclear fusion process. If this actually becomes successful, it could ensure unlimited supply of low carbon and low radiation energy. The team generated 59 megajoules of energy through nuclear fusion, which is double the record that they set in 1997. And it is advocated that nuclear energy is the clear alternative to fossil fuels. Now this gets us thinking, what is nuclear fusion? And also there is a similar sounding word called nuclear fission. So let's talk about these two and break it down for you. Nuclear fusion is the process to infuse two light items into a larger one. This process aims to reproduce what happens in the heart of the sun. Fission, on the other hand, uses uranium atoms from heavy, unstable nuclears and is split into two or more lighter nuclei. Nuclear fission is dangerous and can actually produce radioactive gases in the entire process. Now, estimates suggest that nuclear fusion could produce 4 million times more energy than coal, oil or gas in a cleaner way. Scientists have been trying to make fusion work for more than 50 years and it could still be a while before we can effectively power our homes using it. And hence, there is uncertainty about commercialization. In fact, estimates suggest it could take 20 years to commercialize it. So while it definitely is a cleaner way, heavy investments are needed here and time frame definitely is longer.